12 students were selected to participate in Project Search and they were selected from all the high schools in St. Lucie County. And those students then went every morning to Kaiser College and spent an hour learning all the different skills and things that they were going to need at the hospital. And then from there they went over to the hospital and spent the majority of their day at Cleveland Clinic Martin Health and they um, worked as interns in a lot of the different departments. Yeah, came into this program and it developed into students of the field. You can learn some amazing skills and you guys rocked it out. My favorite time was being in the hospital and working. Like my overall experience that I really loved was EVS and I thought I, that I did a really good job overall. It was very good. Um, she's grown a lot. She's learned a lot and hopefully she'll get a, um, a job out of it. She did very well. So I like to work there like all the time, like you can stock in materials. DBS, I just dump trash and clean around the hospital. I want to get a job to get paid, like to get a real job. Well, I think the biggest thing that you know, we've seen with uh, Project Surge is, is he's been able to develop himself into becoming part of a society, uh, learning new experiences, getting along with um, the environments that he would actually need to be in the future. It went very smooth, much more than we expected it to be. I think because Cleveland Clinic just kind of wrapped their arms around us and you could see how passionate they were for our program and it really helped to just jump in and get started moving forward. Two of the students were employed by the hospital and we have two more students that are interviewing currently and hopefully they're going to be employed. So we think that's a great success rate. One of our students, when they interviewed for Project Search at the beginning of the year and we told the family that she um, had to come into our interview classroom without her parents, her mom looked at us and said, that's not possible because she doesn't talk and now she's hired by the hospital and entering patient rooms with a long script of things that she has to communicate to them in both English and Spanish and is talking and problem solving. The growth that you're going to see inside of your child is going to be invaluable.